When being in Paris, you might get overwhelmed by the many choices of nice picture spots, and you will probably find it very tempting to photograph each and every corner of this city. I'm going to help you find the right place by giving you an overview of my top 10 picture spots. Let's start with the most obvious one, the Eiffel Tower. The majority of people prefer the typical touristy kind of pictures directly in front of it on either the park or the water side. I personally prefer the kind of pictures where the Eiffel Tower is slightly more in the back and not necessarily dominating the whole picture but giving it a typical Parisian atmosphere. These spots are at the Place de la Concorde and the Pont Alexandre. Speaking of the Pont Alexandre, this highly decorated and extravagant bridge definitely makes for a beautiful picture location. And at the Place de la Concorde, you can also take a picture with not only the Eiffel Tower, but with the big wheel in the back. Finding the right picture spot right at the Arc de Triomphe without any other people in it might be challenging, but it is possible. My favorite shot was taken while crossing the busy street. For a beautiful picture with the Notre Dame, I recommend the Pont de l'Archevergie, the Lovelock Bridge, or any other bridge that is close to the Notre Dame. And of course, the Louvre should not be missing since it is the perfect location for a romantic picture. Right next to the Louvre is a very famous cafe that makes for a beautiful picture spot. But be warned, this cafe slash restaurant is also very, very expensive. And for another very expensive cafe, but for a beautiful picture spot that gives you a nice Parisian feeling, go to the Café de Flore. But my favorite cafe in Paris is still La Durée. La Durée is a franchise and you will find it in other cities as well. It is the most typical French spot and it has the best macaroons. In a romantic city such as Paris, a beautiful picture in front of a flower shop shouldn't be missing. Even though it's not necessarily in Paris, but not that far away either, I need to include Versailles to the list, since its gardens and the castle itself definitely make for beautiful pictures. I hope you enjoyed this Paris picture guide and for more information head over to my blog.